Hello guys, welcome back to our channel and community thehuye.com. My name is Derek from The Huye and in this video we are going to talk about everything related to Hekron results. So make sure to watch the whole video to the end to get all your questions answered. As an introduction, HEC in full words is Higher Education Council, which is a body that governs all higher institutions in Gwanda. So for students who applied in the University of Gwanda, if they do not have the ability to pay for their university education, they must apply for loan through HEC. And today we are going to see how you can check your HEC loan results. This video contains four parts. Part 1, how to check HEC loan results. Part 2, how to download your results document from HEC. Part 3, how to reclaim for students who did not get loan. So this part 3 is very important and we will talk about it very deeply in this video. So make sure to watch it if you did not get loan. And lastly, for the bonus part, we will talk about registration at the University of Rwanda and contract signing through Minoza system. To check your results, go in your browser and search for HEC Rwanda. Click the first link that appears. Now scroll down a little bit. Here in online services section, click on HEC Management Information System or MIS. You will be redirected to this page. So now in the top middle right, click on Loan and on Loan Results there down. This is where we use to check loan results by inputting our registration number. Input your registration number and click on view results and now you can see the results for these students. So back to explanation, a registration number is a unique number that is, that is given to a student in university application process and it contains nine digits here in Rwanda. So first check if you have put it in the right registration number and click view or search results. If you search and this red mark appears, this implies that there is an error. So most students panic from this message that says we can't find your registration number. It said that you were not admitted or did not apply for loan. There are two meanings of this message here. Number one, you wrote your registration number wrong or you forgot a number. So first I would advise you to double check to see if it is correct. The other meaning of this message is that you did not get loan from HEC. So you are not lucky to, to get loan from HEC. If you did not get loan from HEC, you will get this message and I'm sorry for you. So for students who are sure that they applied for loan and they meet all the requirements to get the loan, I will tell you at the end of the video what to do in case of reclaiming. So now let us see how you can download your HEC results. Again, input your registration number, click on view results, and in the top left corner, click on this button that says download results, and now you have downloaded your results, you have downloaded your official results document. Now let us talk about how you can reclaim. Reclaim means that you are not happy with the loan results and you want to make an appeal or you just want them to reconsider their decision. That is, you want them to give you loan. There are mainly two or three reasons they did not give you loan in the first place. Reason number one, why you were applying for loan, you did a mistake. Maybe you did a mistake in your registration number or your ID or your names. Reason number two, you did not apply for loan. And lastly, the most obvious reason, you do not have enough marks to get loan to study in the University of Rwanda. For the first two types of students, I advise them to do an appeal. So in order to do an appeal, you must first have the required marks. In order to know the required marks, you can click on the first link in the description of this video and check the required marks and explanation about them. So in order to make an appeal, you must fill this form that is provided on HEC website. If you want to get this form quickly, you can click on the second link in the description, which will direct you to download this form. After getting this form, you must go and print it and then fill it using your pen. I repeat, you must fill it using your pen. 
after filling it using your pen you put it in an envelope and then you deposit through heck headquarters there at kachiru chigali in Mnedike building so this is the official form from heck that is used in reclaiming so in the first row you can see family name maybe i can explain this in Rwanda because this form is in Rwanda. so in form ikoresh kwa mgutangu ujurile bugabati shimiye ibijavu ya mbusaibu nguzanyo mukarungu kambere tulasangamo family name ahangaha uzuzamo izina jiawe gichi nyarwanda mido name yufitiri ndi zina ujigo uzuzamo no no haga tatu ahano anditse first name uzuzamo izina jiawe gichi onjita changi yi jifaransa nukufuga izina jiawe litari gichi nyarwanda ahakane ushiramo registration number ujirajeza wigyo chi uyandi kaneza kukwa yangaya na mahigwe ya nyuma baba guhai registration number ni miwari chenda muri university of Rwanda and iprs Aga tanu ushiraho imeli yawe ikora neza anga kubera uri kwandikisha ikaramu hujira nawe kwandika ibintu binini kandi ukabyandika neza kuko iyi imeli niyo baba bazakoresha bakoherezaho niba bakwemeye mu buzanyo cyangwa bakwanze ushiraho telefone ikora neza iyi telefone niyo baba bazaguhamagaraho mu gihe hari ibintu badasobanukiwe cyangwa se mu gihe bashaka kuguheriza riza ati zaheke banyuze kuri telefone Anga ba kugiani wa rasa bjinguzanyo yego chango ya anga ha mujina ame gushira mo yego ari kushira mi chinu chukuri wakose ni buta rasa bjinguzanyo gushira mo oya ni wa rasa bjinguzanyo gushira mo yego anga harero ba kugiani wa rasa bjinguzanyo ushwa kwa jia ndi ba rebe bjinguzanyo ba kugiani ngo na goje zoa prainga folon vi anu kabji teho ni systemi fiti ibi kugiani kwa tago fasi wazaji shira mo yego kwa rasa bjinguzanyo noneho angaha ugashyira hamwe uta wagize muri sinya 6 no kuvuga ni kuri 63 iyi mu international ushyiramo yo wagize kuri equivalence yawe anga ushyiramo ni miro yiranga muntu yawe uyanditse neza angaha 10 ushyiraho umwaka wakoreye ikizamini cy'a leta gisoza amashuri yisumbuye angaha wandika impamvu y'ubujurire anga mu mpamvu y'ubujurire baba gusaba gusobanura amagambo make ukuntu kibazo cyawe giteye Angaha ibazo by'abantu babigiye bitandukanye ariko anga ikintu ugira mu inama no kuvuga amanota ufite hasi nabwiye mu ko muri bukande kuri link ibereka amanota fatizo anga yufite amanota fatizo urabivuga ukabisobanura nta kindi kiba gihare mu gihe udafite amanota fatizo nubundi yiformu cyangwa kujurira nta kintu babikimaze kuko ntabwo baba bari buguhe inguzanyo na none Now let's talk about the bonus part of this video which is registration and contract signing with Minoza. So registration is a process that is done through University of Rwanda student system. By doing registration you are accepting the facility that you got in your acceptance letter and you must have loan or any other type of funding before you do registration at the University of Rwanda. So, Registration is what confirms that you are a University of Rwanda student. So for more information on how to register, you can subscribe first to the channel and then go in the video section, you will see the video on how to register. So contract signing through Minoza is a process where you accept BRD agreement by signing the contract and inputting your bank details so that you can get that monthly stipend that all students need so for the video to do contract signing through minoza system is coming out maybe tomorrow or the day after tomorrow in three days after i upload this video that video will be on this channel so make sure to check our videos in order to see that video thank you very much for watching this video till the end we have one question for you should we make our videos in Kinyarwanda language or should we make our videos in English language? We want to know this so that we can continue to help you by making more videos that explain university concepts and how to apply specifically for Rwanda. So please tell us down in the comments if we should make videos in Kinyarwanda or videos in English. Thank you very much and good luck in your university education and applications.